In this lecture, we'll be taking a look at how we can create models with migrations. Now, in order to create models with migration, we'll be making use of PHP artisan command. And like in our previous example, we had a model called student. Now, if I have to create another model, let's call it as bakery and uh, all I need to do is specify it with this minus M and then press enter. So this is going to create a model with migration as well. So as of now, we have not configured our database, but in future lectures where we'll be covering that portion, we'll see how we can make use of migrations to create the tables. And one thing to note over here is like over here, I gave bakery as the example, but you can see the name of the table that got created in the migration is bakeries. So here inside the database directory under migrations, you'll notice the bakeries table. And this is something which it creates on its own. So the ID and timestamp, these are the columns that will be included in the bakeries schema. And here it says you delete the bakeries table if it already exists in the system. So that's how the migration script is created. And obviously the model is created inside the root directory over here app. And there you'll see bakery.php. So that was some of the common commands that we'll be making use of in upcoming lectures.